Well, good afternoon, everybody. Camila here. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. I know it has been quite some time since I have posted a video. What better time than it is now? Um, I know I haven't posted in a while because, like I said before, um, priorities come first. Um, I do work a part-time to full-time job, so it makes it hard for me to post videos but due to the circumstances um i decided to make a video um why not um if you have not already subscribed to my channel go ahead and hit that subscribe button click that gray notification bell that will alert you to any new videos that i um will post or may post but um anyway Today's video is going to be a cumulative haul. Yes, a cumulative haul. I picked up quite a few items um, prior to this situation that we got going on here. And once again, I hope you all are doing well. Really, I do. Um, take care of yourself. You are a priority. Your family is our priority. Um, please take care of yourself. Um, and if you find yourself um, need an additional help, uh, notify your uh, local mental health services that will help you and guide you, in, guide you um, onto the right track. But anyway, like I said, um, this is a cumulative haul um, prior to the current situation. I have stuff from Key Australia, Nordstrom Strack, um, Sephora, Bath and Body Works, Bloomingdale's, Lululemon, um, Burlington, At Home, Sam's Club, Barnes and Nobles, etc. But um, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this uh, video. Um, and before we get into the video, I just want everybody to dream often. Okay, uh, so let's go ahead and start with um, Key Australia. Um, it is a very well known sunglass company um, with collabs with people such as J Lo and other um, and uh, other ins with J Lo. Excuse me, I'm stumbling over my words, but um, they did a collab with Jennifer Lopez and I can't think of her boyfriend's name, but anyway, so um, they were having a sale. I think buy two get 15% off. So I went ahead and took advantage of the sale. And I brought uh, two pairs of sunglasses. Um, the quality sunglasses for a fraction of the price. And like I said, I got two. Um, the ones that I got were Get Down and Stop and Stare. And I think Get Down, um, they are these um, aviators, these gold trim aviators with glitter on the frames, as you can see. They retail for... Um, how much they retail for? I think they were 65 or 55 But anyway, I bought a pair. These are, um, they bought these out for, in preparation of Coachella. And they look cute, especially when the sun hits the glitter that's in the frames. Um, the second pair that I got are um, Get Down. Which one did I put in? The first pair that I tried on were Stop and Steer Twist. And the second pair that I purchased are called Get Down. They're kind of like cat eye shaped uh, sunglasses. And I think these were, I'm looking for these. Let's see. And each um, sunglasses, each pair comes with a sunglass case. And it says Key Australia. Q-U-A-Y, but it's pronounced key. So I've got, so stop it, stare was 65 and get down, they are 55. FYI, this may be a long video because I got quite a few items that I accumulated. And they, they wrap them up really, really good. Um, and they have the gold frame. Like I said, these are cat eye shape, which are my favorite kind of sunglasses. And so these are how these look. 
so I am ready um, for the summer so these are once again um, get down and they retail for 55 um, moving right along I oops these may fall out moving right along I picked up oops, excuse me I picked up the hair love book we all know they received an Oscar for um, a short film this is the cutest little book and um, you can also check it out on YouTube very very cute um, I picked up six of these and I um, sent them out to friends of mine who had little girls around this little girl's age okay um, next I purchased um, some stuff from Sephora which is my favorite store I think I had a coupon I don't know I just went in and I wanted some stuff which is usually how it is at Sephora so um, I picked up um, the Toka miniature replica dual I picked up this set and it comes in the St. Florence and Guletta, Guletta. So I can't wait to try that. Um, I also picked up a mini black tea kombucha facial essence from Fresh. I actually didn't want this, but anyway, this is a travel size. I do have a big size of this. I wanted the um the toner, but um Sephora, FYI Sephora's um VIB sale is coming up for VIB. Um it is April 21st. I don't know about the rest of them, but uh, for VIB it's April 21st and it's 15% off. And the next items that I got were the uh, Origins um oil-free energizing boosting gel moisturizer. Pick this up. And I know with the VIB sale coming around, I I will be focusing on purchasing skincare items unless by that time the stores open up. But um, if not, I will mainly purchase, um, this smells good. I will mainly purchase skincare items. I won't be purchasing any foundation because I don't want to go back and forth with buying foundations. I don't I don't have time for that. And then I picked up a fresh sugar watermelon hydrating lip balm. Um, and then I picked up a Fenty glass balm and glass slipper. I do believe this is the clear one. Uh, yep, this is the clear one. Um Mover, oh, I forgot to tell you, from Key Australia, I also picked up a couple of sunglass cases. Because I got, I need sunglass cases for my sunglasses. I have one in red glitter. Which is this one. This is how it looks. And then, it comes flat, but then you open it up so you can have it for your sunglasses and it folds right back up and I got one that's holographic um, that's it for um, Sephora and Key and then the next thing I purchased I went to Orange County and I was just out and about I forgot to bring a jacket so I needed a jacket so I went to Lululemon and I got this jacket and they wasn't lying when they say Lululemon is expensive so I got this one from Orange County and this one was a hundred this is this one was hundred and twenty dollars I can't think of the name of it but it's very comfortable and I love it I love the color and it have, comes with the hood yep I paid hundred and twenty dollars for it um, next um, I went to my favorite spot, used my coupons, I went to Bath and Body Works, and picked up one, two, 
I picked up two moisturizing body washes in Cactus Blossom and Pretty as a Peach. I also picked up um, a mini and a large size of white jasmine. You can also find these in candles. Um, I picked up um, two more cards. Um, excuse me, sorry. I picked up two more car scent holders in this cute little turtle and this cute little kitty. All for the spring, ready for the spring. And then I picked up, I have another mini um, shower gel, but this is in the scent uh, Perfect Peony. I do believe I got this for free. Most of these items, I'm going to say majority of the items I got for free because um, I belong to the Bath and Body Rewards program. So I was able to get a lot of this for free. Um, I picked up the Super Soft Foot Cream. Um, I have a large size Shea Butter Hand Cream. Now at Bath and Body Work, you could get some of the hand creams in a larger size in a large size instead of the small size now. Um, and then, I thought I had more of these. I picked up these um, air diffuse, air, what do they call these? Um, these concentrated rooms, these suckers is strong. Um, I got Waikiki Beach Coconut. I got Fresh Cut Lilacs, which you can also get these two in a candle. You can also get I don't, it's fresh cotton in, I think fresh cotton you can get in a candle. Um, I have another fresh lilac. And I have rose water and ivy. These are some strong room sprays. They're concentrated. So <laughs> make sure you you have a window wherever you spray this stuff. Because you're going to be coughing. And people are going to be looking at you like you're crazy. So make sure you um, have the windows open. Anyway, moving right along. I have some more bags. So it may be a part two to this. Just, it may be a part two. Um, next, I picked up a few items from um, Victoria's Secret. I During their um, yearly, half yearly sale. I only picked up, I picked up some shirts. I think I picked up some underwear, but that was just too, I ain't gonna put mine, do that anyway. Uh, so I picked up two shirts, two t-shirts. I love my Victoria's Secret t-shirts. I picked up one, I picked up this one in this teal color. Um, and then I have another t-shirt in an aqua color. And then I have another one that's in a forest green with stars. I think I paid $4 for each one of these shirts. I take that back. Each one was six dollars, so but that was a good deal. I got three. Um, next, I got I got some stuff. These was wrong. Um, I put I picked these up from TJ Maxx. These are Adidas. I no, I'm just kidding. Adidas. Um, I picked these up from TJ Maxx, and the reason why I picked these up because I was watching Pretty and Flawed. I will post her down below, um, and she showed these. I was like, oh, I got to have those. These are bomb back. So I went over to all the TJ Maxx's to see if I could find these shoes, and let me tell you, I found them. I couldn't. Oh, my God. I love me some Adidas. I have quite a few pairs of Adidas. Um, some are collectors and some are just, man, I picked these up. I just, I just had to have these. These are bomb.com. I couldn't resist. These are fire. Pick these up. Um, next, um, I picked up a few items from Farmington. Um, so I picked up this cute little, um, just because jar, I don't know what I could use this for, but anyway, pencils, makeup brushes, 
I could probably use this for just about anyway. But it says on the front, it says, just a girl boss building her empire. I just thought that was cute, very cute. Um, then I picked up this um, uniform top. I thought that was a good deal. Ready for the spring, has a Hawaiian theme to it. Butterfly, flowers, palm trees, loved it. Um, then um, picked up a, I don't know, a hoodie. And I, I just had to have it, couldn't resist. It'll go with my bands. I just thought this was cute. Picked that up. It has, like I said, it's a hoodie. It's a pullover. Just thought that was super cute. Um, yeah, that's it for Burlington. Next, um, I picked up a few items from... Oh, shoot, I picked up a few items from uh, right before everything's just closed down. I picked up a few items from um, Ulta and one of the items I'm going to have to take back because I, I have two now. Oh, this is a smaller one, so I could probably just keep this and use it for travel. So I have a jar, uh, another jar of Origins Ginseng oil free energy boosting gel moisturizer and this is a smaller jar and it might have been on sale and that's why I picked it up so I just went ahead and picked it I'll have two so I can travel with this one um, then I picked up a vitamin C by the brand Teamy it's a tea infused serum for my skincare and this is how it comes. And then lastly, I got um, another essence. Let me tell y'all, get some, get an essence for your skincare. It makes a big difference. Um, I'm going to be filming my March uh, favorites pretty soon. So these essence game changer with your skincare game changer so this um it's a hyaluron skin essence and it's by a by hand skin i think it's hand hand skin i think it's a korean brand i'm not for sure but this is what it looks like uh, it's, it's sealed so i can't smell it but essence Skin essence are game changers. Um, that's it for um, that's it for Ulta, and then I got a few um, long sweaters from Sam's Club. I got two. Down. I got a I don't know what color this is but these are just long cardigans to wear with leggings or if you just want to lounge I got one in gray and one in I can't think of this color I don't know what color this is but anyway it's cute um next thing next thing I got I went to blooming Bells. Oh, before that, um, I picked up this cute case from Velvet Caviar. It has the ring holder. Check out Velvet Caviar um, if you'd like to see a video on the um, phone cases that I picked up. Um, let me know down below. But this is cute. Um, I love boba, so I have me a boba telephone case. Um, so I went to Bloomingdale's. Everybody is infatuated with this, this uh, perfume called Baccarat. It's Baccarat. Hold on a minute. It is... Hold on. Let me pull it up. Baccarat. It's Baccarat and it's by Mason Francis Cordijan. So let me go... This is it. Oops. Hold on a minute. Everybody is infatuated with this 
perfume and it's Baccarat and it retails for $425. I went to go check it out to see how I would like it. I personally don't like it. So I picked up um, the Mason Francis Cartesian Paris and La Rose. And they're, yes, they're small, but I bought the small ones because I didn't want to commit to the um, big one. That particular one retails for, I think, $325. And this is how it comes. This is fire. I love this. I like this better than the Baccarat, which is the one everybody loves. I don't like the Baccarat. I like this one. And then there's another one called Fluidy. I like that one as well. And this, these little things right here, they come in a pack of three and they retail for $177. No, I take it, it retails for $165, but with taxes, $177 is $79. For those three little perfumes. But let me tell you, it is fire. I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, don't have anywhere to go right now, but that's okay. Um, so next, I went to Nordstrom Rack. Let me just tell you, you can come up at the Nordstrom Rack. You can come up, you can come up. I'm making so much noise, but you can come up, you can come up, come up. So anyway, um, I picked up three items. I picked up this cute little makeup bag that says, um, when light gives you curves, go ahead and flaunt them. And it's in this, and it's in pink and it's super cute. Next, I got this, um, Laura Geller. New York Glow Your Way, Glow Your Own Way two piece luminous collection. And it comes with a lip gloss and, of course, the ever so famous um, highlighter and gilded honey. I do have a small one, a travel size one of gilded honey, but this is the big one. And it retailed for $12.97. This was a good deal because this by itself. Retail, so I do believe $30. Um, and then man. So I was, of course, in the Sue section and um I was in the shoe section, you guys, and I saw these shoes. They were stilettos, they're booty stilettos. And they have an animal print. I think it's, they have a leopard animal print. I mean, the fabric is fire. So I'm trying them on. And then I look at the price and it said $19.95. I said, you a lie. Because I know y'all go, what the fuck? These shoes ain't no $19.95. I said, nah, nah. So I tried them on and I was like, okay, yeah, I got to have those. So I go up to the cash register. I said, I just want to make sure this is not a joke. Because the last time I went to Nordstrom's Rack, I saw these fire, these fire booties. They were Balmain. They were Balmain. And I was like, I know these suckers ain't no $2.99. $299. You know me. I was just sitting there. I was like, shit. So I just gonna drop that $300 on these Balmains. Just, I mean, because I'm like, I know these ain't $299. I just, oh, they not. And so I walked away from them. I mean, I had, I just walked away. And I was like, shh. So I went home and I looked up those shoes. And when they said $1,200, I could have slapped myself in the throat. Because they were selling for $299. If I can find them shoes in a picture, I will post them. If I can, if I can figure out how to post them. But anyway, the current shoes that I got now that I went into Nordstrom's Rack and I was killing time. And these said 1999. I said, I know they're alive. So like I said, I went up to the um, cash register and I said, is this a joke? Cause I know these ain't 1999. These cannot be 19. Look at that. That says 
Michael Kors. I know. I was like, I hope these people think I ain't trying to uh, uh, do a switcheroo up in here and harm my ass for jail. Because I know these suckers ain't no 19... And the, the, the little guy was looking at me and he looked at, and he looked at the, the cashier next and he said, look at these. She found this for $19.99. Cashier, the cashier that was... And I, I was like, Lord have mercy. Let me show you that. I couldn't, I couldn't walk away from these, y'all. 1997. I said, are these the real? I know 1997, y'all. So I'm going to have to go on the Michael Kors and see if I can find these. Because I said, are these fake? Because I, I, the 1997, focus. You think I was going to leave these in the store? Absolutely not, but I thought these were a good deal. I'm going to have to look them up to just make sure these are not fake. Um, they don't have a name to them. I don't know. I, I you know, I don't know. Anyway, I got these for $19.97. Okay, everybody, I forgot some other stuff. Um... And also on those Michael Kors shoes, I'm going to have to do some investigation. I'm going to have to do some research because I cannot find those particular ankle booties anywhere. So I'm going to have to do my research. I'm going to maybe have to go to a Michael Kors um, outlet or store to see if those aren't um, knockoffs. Because I don't like knockoffs, but um, they're still fire. I can't say that they're not. They're bomb.com and if they are real for 1997, that was a good deal. But anyway, I forgot I also have some more stuff from Alta. And I also picked up more shoes from um off Broadway. And they were having a sale and I couldn't pass them up. So hey, what can I say? And I love shoes, so. So I picked up these cute little booties and they are made from, they are made by, who are these? Carlos by Carlos Santana and what drew me to these are the little fringes in the back. I love that. I love a shoe with a personality and I just love the fringe on the back of the shoe. And then I like the heel as well. Um, hopefully, uh, once this is all over, I'm going to start wearing my shoes because they're just sitting in the closet just collecting dust. And if you want to see my shoe collection, hopefully I can get that together. But um, I do have a video um, that I can link down below where I got rid of a lot of shoes. I mean, like, a lot of shoes. Um, so, anyway, so the other pair of shoes that I got, I love me some Pumas. What is this? I love Pumas. Um, I got quite a few pairs. I think I have like two or three pairs of Pumas. And the Pumas that I got, they're like OG Pumas. I bought them maybe 10, 15 years ago. Um, when um, they had, when they still had Lady Foot Locker. Now they just have Foot Locker. But yeah. And I also got a lot of my Adidas from Lady Foot Locker as well. But I got these Pumas. I thought they were just fire as well. Um, they are cheetah print. I believe they're cheetah print. Let's see. Yeah, cheetah print. These are the California style um, Pumas. So I got these. And they do have the soft um, foam inside. Um, these are new type of Pumas. The Pumas that I grew up with. Um, they're the old school ones. But I picked these up from um, Off Broadway and I thought these were just cute. Um, I like I like any type of shoe with a personality. Um, and I picked those up, such as the Adidas that I picked up as well. Um, so, um, I, once again, I picked up a few items from um, Sephora. Um, not Sephora, but just that place, Ulta. So I picked up, everybody was raving about the Thrive Cosmetics um, mascara. So I picked up, did, uh, picked up 
one because they are hard to come by either you can get it from Sephora or not Sephora you either you get it from Ulta in store or you can get it online or you can go to the uh, Thrive um, website I can't wait to try this one I do I like this one and I also like um, the Bad Gal by Benefit um, mascara that one is cute I mean not cute but that one is good and I have a lot of other mascaras in my um, drawer that I do need to try that I've never opened but I love the Bad Gal one by Benefit um, I have of course I, I had to do it um, I picked up the Amrezy, um palette I do have the Jackie Ina palette I know you guys I really I know I need to start using some of this makeup that I've heard through. I, I just never find I need to start finding the time to use it and this is how it comes and the glitter doesn't come off cute palette um so these are the colors can't wait to use them but this is how the palette looks like I said I do have the Jackie Ina palette um, I have not picked up any of the, um, I can't think of her name. It'll come to, I didn't get the Cardi Bible palette because I didn't think that would be good for my skin tone. It looked a little, it looks like it would be a little chalky. So I didn't pick that one up. Um, and then of course, I picked up some more stuff from Ulta. I picked up uh, Origins um, mini kit and I got checks and balances, face wash. I have the oil free um, boosting gel moisturizer and then I got an eye cream and it all came in this little kit. Um, I'm current, the eye cream that I'm currently using is by the brand Fresh and it had, and it's the black, black tea um, eye cream and I guess it's working, I guess. Um, lastly, two, the last two items, I picked up a Nest Ocean Mist and Coconut Water Hand Cream in the scent Ocean Mist and Coconut Water. Um, can't wait to see how this is. I do have a Toka Hand Cream that um, I have in my closet that I haven't used yet. I have a lot of hand creams because I wash my hands a lot. Um, I did, it does smell good. Um, I tend to like to put these creams in my purse when I'm going out. Um, the little creams that I get from Bath and Body Works, I put those in my um, work bag um, when I'm at work. Um, but yeah. Next, I got um, these little pimple patch sets. Um, for ac it's for acne pimple master patch times three. Clear Fit Master Patch times one. So these little, ouch. So these little things you put on your trouble spots if you have acne. And they, they come like this. I also have some from another brand and they're hearts. And this is what they're, you just put these on your pimples and they're supposed to um, help them go away. Acne Pimple Master Patch and Clear Fit Patch. So I'm going to have to read the directions on these and get back with you guys on these. Maybe do another skincare routine and show you how to use these. But anyway, I want to thank you for watching. I hope you continue to do well. Um, yeah, I hope you continue to do well. Um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Click that gray notification bell. And... Like I said, um, I will be um, posting my March favorites and also I do have an empties video um, that I was supposed to post many moons ago, but I never got around to it. But now I guess I have a lot of time to get around to a lot of stuff and I also have a video that I'm going to do on items that I that I purchased post this situation. I've been doing some online shopping and I purchased a few items so I will um, post that video down. I will post, get that video up and running as well and then also get into some of these, do some makeup um, tutorials for you, for you guys and yeah, I have nothing but time now but anyway, once again I hope you have an amazing weekend, um, stay safe.
do what your uh, local government asks you to do so we can get this over and done with and once again um stay safe thank you and thank you for watching and i hope you have a good day